Hello students, our subject for today is Maths, Chapter Number 7, Circles. Children, in this lesson, we are going to learn about Center, Radius, Diameter, Chord, Arc, Circumference, Interior and Exterior of a Circle. Children, before beginning with our lesson, I am going to show you how to draw a circle. Children, to draw a circle, we use compass. Here, you all can see compass. Children, compass is very important object to draw a circle. This compass is having two arms. One arm of a compass has the metal point, while the other arm has a place to fit pencil. Children, here I am going to use sketch pen so that you all can see the circle clearly. We can also say that this is the holder for pencil. This is the compass needle. Children, to draw a circle, we are going to take convenient measurement by using ruler. Here, we will start measuring from 0 cm. You can take 5 cm, 6 cm, 7 cm. I am going to take 6 cm. Children, you all can see I have taken 0 from 6. So, 6 cm. After taking the convenient measurement between the pencil point and the metal tip. Place metal point, means metal tip, in between. So, children, our circle is ready. We only have to rotate it. Children, here we put metal point and we draw a circle by using this sketch pen. This point is known as center of a circle. So, children, this is the Center of a circle. Children, I hope you all understood how to draw a circle. Children, you can take convenient measurement by using ruler. Children, can you all tell me some circular objects? Yes. Here, I will show you some circular objects. Like ball. These coins. Bangle. These are the circular objects. Children. Now one by one we will learn few concepts about circle. Here I already showed you about center. This is the center of a circle. Center of the circle is the Fixed point from which the circle is drawn. जैसे बच्चों हम center का use करके circle बनाते हैं, तो जहाँ पर हम metal tip रखते हैं, वो होता है हमारा center. Children, where we put the metal tip, that is the center of a circle. By using center of a circle, we draw a circle. Our next term is radius. Radius is the segment that extends from the center of the circle to any point on the circle. Children, any point on the circle we can draw but that should be connected with center. Means so radius is the segment that extends from the center of a circle. 
So, this is the radius. Now, let's learn about diameter. Diameter is the segment that joins any two points on the circle. Any two points on the circle and always passes through the center of the circle. Children, diameter always passes to the center of the circle. Diameter is the largest chord of a circle. But children, what is meant by chord? Let's learn. Chord is the segment that joins any two points on the circle. But you all can see, chord is not touching to the center of a circle. But it is joining any two points on the circle. The diameter is the largest chord of a circle. Circle ka sabse bada chord kon hota hai to wo hota hai diameter. And diameter passes from the center. But you all can see whether the chord is passing from the center. No. Even radius is touching to center. Diameter is passing from the center. But chord is not even touching to the center of a circle. Our next term is an arc of a circle. Children, here you all can see circle. P, S, Q, R. Are the points on the circle. On the circle means they are situated on the circle. Now we will see point P and point Q. These two points have divided the circle into two parts. Here because of PQ the circle is divided in two parts. Part 1 is P, R, Q and the Next part is P, S, Q. So children, these are the arc of a circle. Each of these parts is an arc of a circle. We, write, we will write the arcs. Arc, P, S, Q. And arc, P, R, Q. Children, PSQ means PQ are the end points of the arc. Here, P, R, Q are the end points of the arc. Matlab P or R, P or Q ke yaha pe hamara arc khatam ho raha hai. Is liye usse bula jata hai. End points of a arc. To bacho end points kaun se hai? P or Q. P as Q is one arc and the another arc is P R Q. So children, these are the, this is our one arc. And this is our second arc. Students, I hope you all understood about the arcs. We will move further. Our next concept is the circumference of a circle. Children, here I am going to use one glass. You all can see this upper portion of the glass. Yes, this is the circumference. Now I am going to use this thread. Hold it tightly. So children, the circumference of this circular object means this circle is this but we are going to measure this by using ruler. 
So children, this is 15 centimeter. Children, in this way, you can measure the circumference of a circle. Children, for this, you will have to put it like this. Stretch it. And this is completely 15 centimeter. So children, we can say that the circumference of this circle is 15 centimeter. Children, we can say that the circumference of this circle, this is the circular object. So children, the circumference of this circle is 15 centimeter. Children, now we are going, I am going to teach you the interior and exterior of a circle. Children, interior means the points which are situated in the interior of a circle. Matlab jo points under hai. And what is meant by exterior? Exterior means with the points which are situated in the exterior of a circle. Points in the interior of the circle. Children, now we are going to see that which points are in the interior of the circle. Children, the interior part I have colored with brown color. So, we will write the interior points are P, point B, Point A, point C and point Y. These points are in the interior of the circle. Now we will see which points are in the exterior. Matlab circle ke bahar kaun se points se. Here X, point Y, point M. And point W. Our next question is points on the circle. On the circle. Matlab jo circle ke upar hai. So children D. Point D is on the circle. Point N is on the circle. Point T is on the circle. So students. I hope you all understood interior points, exterior points and points which are on the circle. Children, here you all can see center, radius, diameter and chord is there. I will show you how to write center. So, children, our center is point P. Can you all tell me the chord of a circle? Here I have written C H O R D chord. Chord. Chord is A B. Now tell me the diameter. Here the diameter is there. C. D, C, D, radius, P, Q, here I have written radius, so right here, P, Q is the radius, children, but in one figure, there are, there can be many radius, means radii, diameters and chords. Children, the plural for radius is red eye. Red eye. This is the singular and plural for radius is red eye. Red eye. Now children, here we are having one more figure. By using this example, we are going to write, first we will write, Center of a circle. 
can you all tell me which is the center of a circle yes a is the center of a circle now we are going to write red eye red eye this is the plural for yes this is the plural for radius children we will see a s this line is extended from the center and touching the circle in one point but it is extended from center so here radius is as aq you all can see aq aq is extended from the center a after that a t a b so children in this circle we are having 1 2 3 4 4 radius so we will say these are the red eye of the circle these are the red eye of the circle we completed center red eye after that chord children now tell me which are the chords yes here r and p one chord i have written this is also the chord c d because this line is not even touching to the center of a circle but it is touching to the circle in two distinct points d and c so this is the chord of a circle children i explained you that diameter is the largest chord of a circle diameter is the largest chord of a circle so which is the diameter here q b so in the chord column i am going to write diameter for why i will write here diameter because diameter is the largest chord of a circle diameter ye circle ka sabse bada chord hota hai to hame chord ki column mein diameter likhna zaruri hai so children here our one more diameter is there that is s e so children keep in mind that diameters you will have to include in the chord column after that diameter now tell me the diameters s e and one more diameter is there q b so children from figure you all can find certain center red eye chord and diameter children chord and diameter are interconnected it means diameter is the largest chord of a circle but in the same way radius and diameter is also connected but how Ch children we will see that here our radius is db i will write radius db tell me the value of radius 6 cm now tell me the diameter yes our diameter is ac diameter is ac but children what is the measurement of diameter ac we don't know that we are going to find but how we will find children diameter is double than the radius means if we want to find diameter we are going to use the formula 2 into r r means radius 2 into radius so children 2 into r r means our 6 
children why i have written two here because diameter is double double than the radius double means we have to multiply here by 2 2 6 are 12 12 centimeter so children diameter is 12 centimeter children diameters if i will write draw here one more diameter that will be of same measurement 12 centimeter if i will draw here one more radius that will be 6 centimeter because all the diameters of the same circle are of equal length मतलब एक ही सर्कल के ये एक ही सर्कल हम देख रहे हैं ना तो ये एक सर्कल में आप कितने भी रेडियस निकालो वो सभी की मेजरमेंट होगी 6 सेंटीमीटर और बच्चों हम इसी सर्कल में हमें जितने चाहे उतने अगर हम डायमीटर्स निकालते हैं तो उनकी मेजरमेंट होगी 12 सेंटीमीटर मींस रेडियस means radii of the same circle are of equal length. Diameters of the same circle are of equal length. We will see, here we learned how to find diameter from radius. In this question, we are going to learn how to find the value of radius. Here, Diameter, diameter is PS. The value of diameter is 14 centimeter. And children, the value of radius, we don't know. So, we will write P R Q. And in front of that, I am going to put question mark. Children, Radius is half than the diameter. Radius is half than the diameter. So, 1 upon 2 multiply by diameter. So, radius is equal to half. Means 1 upon 2 multiply by diameter. Diameter is 14 centimeter. Children, we will check whether 14 is coming in the table of 2. Yes. 2 1s are 2. 2 7s are 14. So 1 into 7. 7 1s are 7. So the radius is 7 centimeter. Radius is 7 centimeter. Children, here. Orally we will find the value. We only have to multiply and only have to divide. Here complete the table is your question. Radius is given 5 cm. Can you all tell me the value of diameter? Yes, diameter will be double. Because diameter is hai? Bada bhai hai. Or radius chota bhai hai. So diameter kitna hoga? 10 cm. We will see next question. Here we have to find the value of radius and diameter is given to you. 14 is your diameter. Matlab hume bade bhai ki value pata hai. Bada bhai hai 14 centimeter. To chota bhai kitna hoga? Usse aadha means 7 centimeter. Children, easy hai na bohat. Now, your next question is, radius is 10 cm, we have to find diameter. So, children, diameter will be double than the radius. So, diameter will be 20 cm. See the next question. Here, diameter is 16 cm, find the radius. Yes, right, children, the answer is 8 centimeter. Students, I hope you all understood the lesson well. Children, in this lesson we learnt how to draw a circle in that we learnt many concepts about circle. 
थैंक यू